So where did you grow up? Well, I was born in the Netherlands, and then I moved to Germany, so I lived there for about eight years. My dad was in the military, so we moved, you know, a lot. That was really sad leaving, you know, and that was, um, we left, you know, to move to the States. And then I moved to New York and was dancing there, but I like traveling now. I think that's what made me probably like traveling now. Tell me about your very, very first audition. It was long, and I just remember being hungry and nervous all day. It was really long. I was, like, the second to last group to go out of however many thousands of people. It was the longest day of my life. You have a quality that just draws us in as an audience. Liar. Absolutely <laughs> incredible. I'm gonna go to Vegas! I'm so excited! Is there something for you that really stands out about the competition? For me, it's um, Wade's piece, I think. Me and all my friends. The solo, you know, and just what it symbolized. It showed a little bit of everybody's personality. You know, we got to kind of do our own thing and see how we each would take, you know, one choreography and do with it, you know, in 10 different ways. You've got this little itty bitty body and out came this like mammoth. <laughs> I'm a loud person, so I guess, I guess that's, I don't know. Everybody's always telling me I'm really too loud, so. I don't know how every week you would let Dominic throw you around like he did, because every time he would drop you. You know, it wasn't all the time his fault. There were some things, you know, like in the contemporary routine, I just kind of knew that I was going to land wrong, so I just kind of let my body go limp so it didn't hurt so bad. Are you OK? There was the really bad one during the group routine. Oh, that was bad. He just missed me, and I just fell straight to the floor didn't hurt that bad. You know, with all our adrenaline going and everything, definitely helps. And what are you hoping to take away from the competition? I've learned a lot about dance, you know, just being around all these brilliant people, you know, made my mind so much more creative, you know, than it was before. And hopefully I can take it all with me and remember it all and not take anything for granted. Now it's time to see what she can do dancing solo in her own style. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Sabra. Lovely. Okay. Nigel. Um, I, I said it in the package. You, you have this energy that draws us into you. It's, it's a marvellous quality that you just can't give to people. And you can't teach people how to do it. You either have it or you don't. You have got it. It's a piece of magic. Mary. We can keep saying it all the time about all the different qualities and just for dancing four short years, you have everything it takes to be the champion of this show and I just, you inspire, you're inspiring so many people out there right now that think it might be too late for a dance career when they see what you can do in only four short years. You are a miracle. Thank you. Thank you so much. Just the beginning. Done. Uh, I'm not going to lie. I was on the other side with you for a while. I thought Dominic was carrying you through the competition for a while. Uh, I, I don't know. He just, you know, for some reason, my focus went to him quite a bit of the time when you guys were dancing together. Um, boy, can you stand alone on this stage and hold your own? I mean, you sure do. You, every time you come out there, you do something else. And, and that surprises the hell out of me. And I mean, you're absolutely amazing up there. You deserve to be here, that's for sure. Thank you. Thank you. Sabra, can you tell me a little bit about what it's like between the top four contestants? Because to me, I see a real sense of camaraderie between you. What's it like? We all get along really well. <laughs> it's just about doing your best. Yeah, I mean, so, yeah. And we're all too stressed to worry about anything else anyway, you know? Of course. <laughs> you, you did a great job. Let's hear it for Sabra. To vote for Sabra, 
You have to call 1-888-TEMPO-04. That's one 888 8376 Remember, these are 888 numbers, not 800 or 866 numbers. And please don't vote until we tell you the lines are open. You'll have at least two hours to vote at the end of the show. Well done. Thank you. Good one. Nice. <laughs> OK. The